bones are a good source of minerals and other nutrients and help satisfy your dog's appetite. Chewing stimulates saliva enzymes and helps prevent plaque buildup on teeth and gum disease. And a dog chewing on a bone is less inclined to excessively scratch or lick his paws. However, many veterinarians believe it just isn't worth the risk of serious injuries to give your dog a bone. If you are considering giving him a bone, here are some rules to follow for his safety. Don't do these things when giving your dog a bone. Don't give your dog the wrong kind of bone. This includes poultry bones and pork bones. Rib bones, especially pork rib bones, are high in fats. Dogs aren't built to handle this amount of saturated fats and can suffer from pancreatitis. Pancreatitis typically shows up as vomiting, lethargy, diarrhea, and a loss of appetite. Don't give your dog cooked bones of any kind. They splinter into shards that can cause choking and serious damage to the dog's mouth, throat, or intestines. Cooking can also remove nutrients from the bone. Don't let your dog chew any kind of bone into small pieces. These pieces create a major choking hazard. Bone fragments can easily get lodged in your dog's throat, blocking the airways and creating an emergency situation. Also, these chunks are typically very sharp and can puncture and cut the inside of your dog's mouth, tongue, stomach, and intestines. Bone fragments, especially rib bones, can cause lodge in a descending colon near the rectum, causing constipation-like symptoms and pain. Don't give your dog a bone if he has stomach problems. A bone in its marrow can make diarrhea, irritable bowel syndrome, or just plain sensitive stomachs even worse. Don't give your dog a bone to chew if there is another dog visiting. Even dogs that are friendly can be very protective of their bones. Do these things when giving your dog a bone. Offer raw meat bones. Raw meat bones are the best bones for a dog. However, you should know that bones that are too hard, even raw bones, could damage your dog's teeth. If a bone is harder than a tooth, the tooth can fracture. Give your dog a bone after his meal. He's not likely to chew it as quickly. Take the bone away from your dog after 10 to 15 minutes and put it in the refrigerator. Dogs have powerful jaws and you don't want your dog to ingest too much bones. Dispose a bone after 3 or 4 days. Bacteria can grow and cause intestinal problems for your dog. Give large breeds such as German Shepherd dogs, Bloodhounds and Mastiffs large bones. Bones should be larger than the length of the dog's muzzle, so they can't be swallowed whole. A beef shank bone is a good example of the type of bone to give to a large dog. Do supervise your dog when you give him a bone. It's very important to check periodically on your dog when he is chewing a bone and be ready to remove it if it's breaking apart or getting too small.